Social media. Or is that social disaster? How's your circle working? Good morning, my name is Ron Morris. This is Moving Forward TV, your local real estate and mortgage update. And I am Delyn Guest and thanks for joining us today. On today's show, we are talking about social media and we are forcing <laughs> my husband, John, to come on and talk to us about social media because if you're not doing social media, you need to be doing social it media. Is you're missing the boat. It is huge out there. And we wanted to show you a little bit about what it takes to get the show going and everything. Okay, I actually have a funny cute story about social media, which just happened to me two weeks ago. As some of you may know, I really enjoy fishing. It's one of my passions. I happen to have a family out, husband and wife and a son. We're fishing, having a great time. They're a little frustrated fishermen, the couple that I had out with me, but we had a great day. The son, who's uh, college age, is, happens to be a friend of my son's as well, ends up catching a you know nice shark. Okay, it wasn't this big, but it was it was the you know fish story. Exactly, pretty <laughs> decent size. We take a picture of it when we're out there on the water. He's he's very excited about it. Let the fish go, life goes on. Couple hours later after we left, I get a phone call from my son who happens to be sitting in Tallahassee, he's going up to FSU, go nose. And he, he calls and he goes, hey dad, I just saw that Matthew caught a nice shark earlier today. Tell me about it. And I'm like, oh my God, how do you know about that? We were just out there two hours ago. I just barely got home, got cleaned up. And you're calling me that you've seen this in Tallahassee? Social media. Social That's media. That's what it happened. He put it on Facebook and blam, it's out there for the world. That very impressed me on how quick that message got out. Nothing to do with real estate, but I think it's an example of the power of social media. You know, and so, I know you have a story. Right. Social media kind work. of started as a, as a great way to keep in touch with your friends and stuff like that and your family from out of state, especially a lot of us relocating people down here in Florida. Well, it's really outside of Florida. You know, from a social media standpoint, our Facebook page and um, our friends and, and our LinkedIn and our Twitter and everything else, it reaches out all over the yeah. country and probably even all over the world. Ron and I get calls and, <laughs> and interactions true. on these from people outside of just our Tampa Bay oh, yeah. area quite a bit. We also get them right from people right, right. around here. So if you're not doing social media on it from a business standpoint, you definitely need to be because people do business who, who, with who they know, like, and trust. No and question. that's real important. I did have a customer who was on Facebook all the time. Most of my customers <laughs> I do, I do friend. As everyone knows, doing mortgages these days, getting loans through are, is very, very difficult. And Ron and I pride ourselves in staying right on top of all of our files and babysitting them all the way through. And it is frustrating for people who are going through it. It's definitely uh, time consuming and, and can get crazy at times and you feel you know, that, like you just right. want to scream. And I had a customer who was kind of doing that on Facebook and I was able to interact with her and write on Facebook and um, you know, we, we kind of got everything turned around and straightened out and happy. So it's really a great tool that everybody needs to be using and, and it reaches all over the place. I am very pleased to introduce my husband and our producer and our director who help us get the show out each and every week. I know he doesn't like being on this side, but he is an absolute guru when it comes to social media. He gets our show out, not only our show out, um, but also he works with a lot of local area companies to do social media campaigns for all of them. A lot of people are kind of intimidated by the whole social media thing, and he is just phenomenal with it. And I'm always asking him questions. People are always asking him questions, so I figured that we would bring him on so that he can kind of share some of the quick little tips and, and insight into the whole social media thing. So, honey. Well, you know, social media has been around for a really long time. People just don't, we just, we just don't didn't realize. Call it that. Yeah, exactly. You know, in the beginning it was chat rooms and then, the, and then instant messaging like with Yahoo and AOL. I remember those. Okay, those were, uh, believe it or not, those were Dinosaurs all now. <laughs> social media, exactly. And social media ultimately um, for, for business owners is a way to get people, it's an engine to get you to the websites. It's great that we're all on the social medias, then we're using the Facebook, the Twitter, the LinkedIn, uh, the BuzzFeed, the social cams, uh, Ustream, believe it or not, even though it's, a, it's more of the video side of it, but it's still a social media, right, right. ultimately drives people to your website. That's where... Which is our goal in business, is to get people going to our website. Exactly. Now, you know, 
a lot of people are intimidated. Yes, they by are. social media. Yes. It, it, they think that Ron. Oh, it's, it's so yeah. Ron, <laughs> love Ron. To we death. had to get him kicking and I screaming know, to I do know. the social media. <laughs> but the whole point of it is, is it's 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 very simple. It's very simple to use. Yeah. Just to set a page up, all you need is, is a username, which typically is your email address, which right. we all have nowadays, and a password. And then once you're on there, you set your security settings up on like on your Facebook. And then once you're in Facebook, the cool thing about it is, is once you've got one established, they all use each other. So you can actually have your Facebook going to your LinkedIn, going to your Twitter, going to your BuzzFeed, going to your Pinterest. It's all a part of one big engine. And, and if you can maybe explain how the whole spider web thing works, because that's kind of well, the way I understood it the best, with the, the, the web. It, it's it's, spider it's web. a spider web, basically. You, you're, you're never, you know the old, the old saying, you're never seven people away from the Pope. Right. Oh. Or Kevin Bacon. Or Kevin Depending Bacon. Depending upon. Exactly. <laughs> what happens is, is you get friends that follow you and that you follow. And the minute you do a post, well, your friends see those posts. Well, because your friends have friends, and their friends have friends, and their friends have friends, that you can literally take five people. Say you have five people on your Facebook, that are, and that's all you have. Well, ultimately, down the line, you can hit almost half a million people because everybody's following everybody else. Right. And and and. And in our business world, we want to make sure that in our post that we're we're talking about today's events. Right. That will get you followed and liked faster, especially with Twitter. If you talk about, you know, you put a little bit of piece of today into your post, it goes viral. And that's right. the whole spider web. Um, the, platform. And events that you have happening and stuff, that's a great way when you're having uh, social networking events or um, you know any kind of networking kind of thing. That's a great way to let people know that it's out there. People are always on there looking for uh, different things. Like I said before, people do business with who they know, like, and trust. We all know that. People get to know you through your social media pages. That, that's correct. They and, like you. They trust you. They use you for business. And, when, and in business, posting is the biggest thing. You know, People say, oh, I don't have time to do it. I don't have time. A lot of people... Yeah. They don't have time. They they are they are these people that literally by the time they walk into their office, their phone doesn't stop ringing to the end of the day. That's why there's people like myself, which we take care of their posting for right. them. But you know, ultimately, you can post. The one thing that we always tell all of our clients: don't put anything on there that you don't want to be there forever, right? Because it can come back and haunt you and haunt you insistently. It's horrible. But Keep it clean, keep it nice, and keep it interesting because the more interesting you are and the more relevant you are, the more people will actually start following you and start liking you. I'm telling you, he knows what he's talking about when it comes to this stuff. Please reach out. If, you don't, if you're not doing it, give him a call. He's, he's happy to help you. Anytime, any day, uh, John Gaston or Tampa Bay Multimedia, you can go to our Facebook page or our website. Website's the fastest way to do it. So if you need me, and you have information, even if you just want information, call me. Thanks, honey. You're welcome. That's our show this week. Thanks so much for watching. And we want to say thanks to John, pulling him out from Kicking behind the camera. Kicking and screaming. We, we finally got Kicking him, and we finally got him out here. He hates that. <laughs> but it was real important information that we wanted to share with you guys. And if you do want to, if you do want to expand your uh, web videos, uh, you know, video on your websites, on your Facebook pages, your Twitter, your LinkedIn, any of that stuff, or your social media, please reach out to him. His banner is down here as well. And I know today's show wasn't primarily about, right. directly about the mortgage industry, but I think we all recognize social media, it's here. Right, it's here And to it's stay. going to expand as time goes on. I know there are, I know a number of realtors that I deal with that obtain referrals and leads from social media. Right. So don't uh, underestimate don't that at all. And of course, if you have any questions pertaining to mortgages, get in touch with myself right. or Delenn. Um, speaking of social media, I guess you could do a Facebook. All those you can, links are uh, here. Tweet us, even though I'm not sure I'll get that, but maybe, maybe you will. I'm not sure. Of course, you can email us can, and give us a, a phone call and uh, text us. Anyway, Texting. reach out to us and we'll be happy to answer your questions. And we also want to mention our partner page over here. Please click on any of these links. These are all of the people that help us get our loans done all of the time and help our clients with uh, after they buy the house. There's a great wealth of information over here. So please feel free to visit their pages and such. Thanks again for joining <laughs> us. We are today and every day. Moving forward. I won't see everybody next week. I'm actually out of town for a couple of weeks. I'm Shut sure Delenn will be here to hold down the here. fort. Until then, I'll see everybody in a few weeks. Thanks, Thanks. for joining us. Bye-bye.
Oh, 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 oh,